This is another episode of the White Demon. <laughs> So, you thought you seen the last of me? <laughs> you got another theme coming. But I have a small problem. YouTube has... Updated terms of service to get rid of harassment. So what does that mean for the white demon? What does that mean for me? <laughs> Are they gonna get rid of me? Because the kids will be harassed? Because I'm I, I, I'm scary. <sighs> What's gonna happen to the white demon? I don't threaten. I don't harass. I, what I do is what I do best. The white demon has spoken. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? Wow, Chroma's out. <laughs> With another episode of the white demon. Ooh, my teeth are purple. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, baby. <laughs> Look into my eyes. What do you see? The white demon. Yeah. Yeah, it's just YouTube shit is fucking full of shit, man. I mean, like... I'm going to miss the hate that I'm going to get on my channel because they're going to fucking delete comments that they see as harassment. You know, it's like, shouldn't that be my choice to do that? You know, it should be my choice to do that. Why does YouTube have to do it for me? Why do they have to police me? They already want, I mean, Copa already wants me to be the parent of, of these fucking children that may run across my videos. So I have to label them, no, it's not for children. You know? Fucking ridiculous, man. Cut myself shaving, that's what these things are. Look like bullet holes. <laughs> you know? But yeah, um, so what's going to happen to the series? I hope the right Demon series stay up because it's like shit about, oh, you're going to, we took your video down because there's harassment to children. You know, they're afraid when they come across and shit, you know, I'm like, I'm like, wait a minute, look at my algorithm. Are there any children visiting my page? I fucking doubt it. You know what I'm saying? It's fucking ridiculous, though. It's like shit. But this, these type of videos here is to bring out the kid in you. You know what I'm saying? Something, that's what I wholeheartedly believe. That's part of the reason why I'm trying to keep this White Demon series up. It's because looking at shit like this, it brings out the child in you. You know what I'm saying? Because we're adults. We, we're, we're busy being adults. You know, we got responsibilities, bills to pay, making that paper so we can pay off the bills, you know? And... Sometimes we need to relax and um, 
and bring out the kid in us. You know, it's like and I don't want to do that. That's what that's kind of the purpose of the White Demon series. You know, but some people just don't fucking understand that shit. It's oh, oh it's scary. Oh. You know, all that bullshit. Look at my white hair, man. I got old. Look at my white mustache. <laughs> so, I don't know, man. This is fucking ridiculous. This YouTube shit. It's like, oh, we've gotten a lot of emails of people saying they've been harassed online. I bet you they came from feminists and SJWs and fucking soy boys. I bet you that's where it came from. Talk, we be getting a lot of fucking. I'm like, won't you? If I was you, Tom, I would say, I would say, you know what? You guys don't need to be on the internet, man. You got to take that shit. You know what I'm saying? But let that shit in increase your brain capacity. You know that the strength in your brain. You know what I'm saying? Develop a thick fucking skin. You know? Jesus Christ. I know my last video, I was kind of, I was really upset, you know, that's why I'm trying to get really angry when I make videos, because sometimes I will say shit, I'll be thinking back, like, damn, I should have said it like that, you know, because when I'm upset, I don't think, I can't think, you know, that's why anger is something that to be avoided, it's not your friend, you know, it's something to be avoided, because when you get too angry, you can't think, so... And I was kind of, I was thinking pretty well, but I was going off, you know. I thought I had to calm myself down and shit, because this shit pisses me off. These soy boys and fucking uh, snowflake-ass girls, man, pissed me off for sure, man. Especially that one bitch really rubbed me the wrong way. She really pissed me off. She was like, oh, I can't wait for you to update terms of services so I can be protected in my fucking safe space and all that type of shit. Fuck out of here, man. Safe space. Hey, baby. I got a safe space for you. <laughs> the white demon is going to welcome you. It's a sad day, though. It is. It's a sad fucking day, man. Take these fucking glasses off. Ugh. I don't usually don't see my glasses off when I'm doing my regular videos, but because I don't have the need to take them off, because I'm taking them off because of the vision. You know, it's, it's a different. It's a different look without the glasses with these negative colors. So. But yes, but it makes my eyes look better. <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not fucking uh, farsighted and shit, because I'd be fucked up. Like, Ugh. Oh, that's better. Huh? As you can see, I'm laying on my bed. So in case you wonder, what the fuck is that in the background? Is it against the wall? Ooh. You know, like, no, I'm not against the wall. Shit. I don't roll like that. It's got through fucking shame and cut myself twice. Put some salt on that motherfucking shit. That's what the black marks are salt. Yeah, put some salt on that motherfucking shit, man. Some motherfucker came out already. Fuck. Yeah, some of the salt already came out, so. Whew. Yeah, I'm definitely when I when I get, if I get too gray, I'm gonna get dressed for man, man. Fuck this shit. People so oh, take pride in your gray hair. I'm not gonna never darken mine. I love my gray. My grandma's the same. My mom's like fuck that. She dyed her thirty different colors to keep her gray out. You know what I'm saying? Despite me saying, oh mom, you got beautiful silver hair. She goes, boy, shut up. I'm gonna dab my hair as soon as I get the chance. Yeah, I'm going to do the same thing, Mom. So, just for men, here I come. Hopefully in about maybe six more years. Till I get fucking salt and pepper looking shit. You know what I'm saying? Shit, fuck that. I ain't finna walk around with no gray ass fucking hair, man. Shit, fuck that. Hey, Grandpa. I'm like, I, I don't got no fucking kids. Fuck out of here. 
Not even a father, you know? Shit. Shit, man. Shit, you think I'm fucked up now? Cause imagine if I got my ex pregnant. I had to deal with her ass just to just to fuck just 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 to see the kid. That's some, that'd be some fucked up shit, man. I should still be in my fucking life. I'd be having a number on my phone and shit. Like, God damn, I'm glad we didn't have no fucking kids. So she wanted to have my kid after two months after she met me. I want to have your baby. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, I ain't ready for that yet. She respected me. Like, okay, cool, you know. Like, shit, we, I mean, I, was, I eventually wanted to have a child with her, you know, eventually. But, shit, she was 10 years older than my mom, so. She, her, her biological clock was probably already fucking dead by the time I met her and shit. Fuck it, hey, man. Yeah, I fucked her raw. No condom. Yeah, I'm stupid, right? I know, we do stupid shit, man. That's human nature. Stupid fucking shit. Yeah, no condom, man. I remember the first time we fucked, too. We wasn't fucked about... Seven times that night, the first night. The demon was released. Uh, so it was about seven times that night. It is funny because the, the, it was the second time when I um, when I saw her for the first time because I met on the party line. Ain't that some shit? Wasn't even fucking looking for it. I was just going to probably just be a fucking fool. And then we start, we connected. We started talking. And, and the conversation was so well. We ended up exchanging numbers, you know. My dumb ass told her I loved her early on and shit. I'm like, fuck it, hey, man. I fucked up for sure with that one. I was like, I love you. She was like, what you say? I said, oh, fuck. <laughs> I was a fucking sick puppy, man. Like, oh, my God, I want a girlfriend. I hate going downtown and seeing couples intertwine. No. All that type of shit, man. What the fuck? I'm so glad to be single now. It ain't fucking funny, man. Shit, I got my fucking left hand. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I love my fucking hand. Oh, yes. Got my porn. I'm fucking fantastic. And I'm a mastic. You know. So yeah, th let me tell you how she fucked me, how she ended up fucking me the first time. I can't, the first time I saw her, everything went well, I could see her, you know, she had that J-Lo booty and shit like she said she had, and um, we hit it off pretty well. I went home, came back the next time to see her. It was the same, everything was going fantastic, and um... One time, she, she, she we ended up going in her room, and uh, she sat me on her bed. She told me she'll be back, and she start talking to me for a little bit. You know, I'm like, okay, cool. You know, I had no idea. She came back in the room with a fucking nighty on and a fucking G string. Now, this is the guy who was technically a fucking virgin all his life. Yeah, I jacked the fuck. I know what the fuck the, felt like to come. You know what I'm saying? But when I saw that G Street, she was modeling in G Street. She said, how you like this? This came from Victoria's Secret. I was like, holy fuck. And I was like, wait a minute. I wasn't trying to fuck you now. You know what I'm saying? So, she, um... Put her hands on me. And before I knew it, I was tearing that pussy up. It was hard to get in at first, though. That shit was fucking tight. She wasn't bullshit. She ain't, she ain't fucked in about a year. Because she had, cause that's the first she fucked was an abusive ass boyfriend. And that pussy was fucking tight. Yeah, a year would do that to a fucking pussy. <laughs> so. It was fucking tight, man. So I was like, fuck, I to get that fuck. But once that was out the way, the hard part. Pff, holy fuck, man. Then I gave her some fucking anal and shit. The next time I was down there. Oh, my God. She ended up shitting on my fucking dick. 
No, no, sh no bullshit. I mean, I was like, what the fuck? I knew it was shit, but I ain't gonna stop fucking her because her ass felt so fucking good. Despite the fact that I accidentally put my dick in her ass. It was actually the how we ended up fucking anally. And she didn't say shit at first. She was like, oh, yes. I was like, wait a minute. I'm not at your fucking shit. I keep going. I'm like, what the fuck? You didn't even tell me into your ass. I didn't even know that, you know? So, but I, but I didn't notice shit on my dick. And <laughs> it was fucking stupid. Until... I, I was doing doggy style and shit. <laughs> I was like, I was like, ah. Oh. I was like, oh shit, you know? <laughs> and I was like, I'm not going to tell her because it feels so fucking good, you know? And the funny thing is, she didn't even know she shitted. And she told me, why didn't I fucking tell her? And I was like, it felt good. I thought you didn't give a fuck or some shit. I thought you knew, but you didn't give a fuck, you know? Shit. I'll tell you one thing. If she want to give me a blowjob, I'd be like, yeah, you're fucking mine. She won't give me no fucking blowjob after that shit. I'd like, yeah, I'm going to clean my shit first. Then you can fucking blow me, you know? You're going to blow me no fucking... With your shit on my dick. That's crazy. Some women are fucking do it. It was once... One dude told his, his friend that. He said... He fucked the girl in the ass and the shit was on his dick. And she fucking blew him. I was like, what the fuck? Sorry for those who are eating. I apologize. I didn't know the conversation was going to get this intense. So, yeah. Um... Yeah, that's it for this fucking bit. This for 17 fucking minutes. What the fuck? So, yeah. Uh, this is Y Chromosome and the White Demon signing out. And I'm signing back to hell. Peace and love. <laughs>